What's up guys? In this tutorial, I will show you how to fix random lag and stuttering when playing Wuthering Waves on your PC. Frame drops, stuttering and random lag is usually caused by a bottlenecked CPU or graphics card. To fix this performance related lag, we will first take a look at your in-game graphics settings. Open up the Wuthering Waves settings by clicking on this gear icon on the bottom right. Head over to the graphics settings section. These settings will have the biggest performance impact when playing the game. Set the graphics quality preset to medium and then set the screen mode option to full screen if you can. Playing games in full screen usually helps maintain a better frame rate. Below, set the resolution to your native monitor resolution. Under custom, choose a frame rate such as 60 FPS if you feel like you can maintain this frame rate while lowering some of the next settings. Set the shadow quality to low as shadows usually cause a lot of frame rate drops if your GPU is a bottleneck to your performance. Set the Special Effects Quality option to low as well as the LOD Bias option. Enable Capsule AO, disable Volumetric Fog and Volumetric Lighting. Below, disable Motion Blur. Enable NVIDIA DLSS and set the Super Resolution option to Automatic. Next, leave the Sharpening option at zero, though you can reduce it if you notice any lag after applying these settings. Disable VSync as this can lower your frame rate. You can enable it again if you experience screen tearing. Lastly, make sure to enable NVIDIA Reflex if you can. When this is done, keep the game running and open up your task manager. On this window, head to the Processes section. Right-click Wuthering Waves and select to go to Details. In the Details section, right-click the Client Win64Shipping.exe application and set the game priority to high. The Task Manager can also show you how many resources the game is using, as well as other applications running in the background. Close the game and some of the resource-intensive applications. Next, make sure your graphics card driver and operating system is up to date. Updating your graphics card drivers is crucial for ensuring smooth gameplay and preventing errors. You can use the GeForce Experience or NVIDIA app to install the latest graphics driver for NVIDIA graphics card, or use the AMD Radeon software. When this is done, make sure your Windows operating system is up to date as well. Open your Windows settings. Navigate to Windows Update and click on Check for Updates. Download and install any available updates and then restart your PC. Keeping your OS up to date helps compatibility issues with your hardware and software. While in your Windows settings, head to the Gaming section. Here, head to Game Mode and make sure Game Mode is enabled. This will disable some features and overlays from other applications to hopefully fix random lag and stuttering when playing Wuthering Waves. Next, head to your system settings and click on Display. Here, make sure you're using the recommended scale and display resolution for your monitor. Below, click on Graphics. In your Graphics settings, click on Browse. And in your File Explorer, navigate to the drive on which you saved the game on. Program Files, Epic Games, Wuthering Waves, Wuthering Waves Game. Select the wutheringwaves.exe application and click on Add. You can then scroll down in this list of applications and click on Options for Wuthering Waves. Set the graphics preference to high performance to make sure your graphics card gets properly utilized as soon as you launch the game. Lastly, make sure you're not overclocking your graphics card and that you have the minimum system requirements to run the game. On the Epic Games page for Wuthering Waves, you can preview and compare the minimum and recommended system requirements. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.